What's up guys? Kevin Coke here and I just want to present to you the brand new smart projector from Digital Dash. That's right. We're gonna look now this smart projector comes here with you know the power button. Of course you cannot use the remote to power it on. That's for some safety reasons. The remote can be used to power it off, but the power button is right here. You get a HDMI outlet right here you connect your HDMI connect to your computer or uh, PlayStation 4 or whatever you have a headphone jack this here is the DC outlet for the power cable and a USB port yeah how impressive reset and the SD card slot right here now before we power this on, let me mention that this of course is a pocket projector. So you can pretty much slide it into your pocket. Yeah. Or in a bag, if you're an on the go person like me. I put it in my pouch, you keep it in your wallet, in your purse, handbag. It's that good. Victors, yes, again, it comes to the police store, I should mention. I mean, it has Wi-Fi, so yeah has Play Store. You have a Netflix app, Wi-Fi display. I don't have this app, this is free. Science Grade 5 is the app I don't have off the Play Store. You can virtually download any app, TV version app off the Play Store, Amazon, yeah. Happy Cast. We're gonna look at that Wi-Fi. And there's a YouTube on this projector. Yeah. I haven't mean, installed the new version, but there's a YouTube on it and it works pretty good. Let's see what's oh, on. Wow, look at that. Our YouTube is already ready to go. Oh, yeah, my favorite match. I'm going to watch this match. Cristiano Ronaldo. Welcome to Live Capitch and the Adios Stadium ah. in Turin from Joe Spate at Sierra. Look at the quality, man. Alright, so we're not going to dwell there. Um. Yeah, it comes with a Google Chrome work. So let's go on the smart view. You'll get an invitation to connect. Yeah, Galaxy S9 Plus, that's me. I've accepted it in about two seconds, I'm connected. Wow. And of course, that is my smartphone. We're on YouTube right there. And pretty much can use this with Google, all sorts of things. Now, with that being done, you click disconnect. So you go back into the smart view, click disconnect, and it will disconnect from your projector. You just put end connection. I pretty much use this phone in my class. Let's go back to um, the screen mirroring app, which is in your settings again. You see that little app there. Android Packet Connect. That's me. Accept. Oh, and I'm connected. Make sure that your screen rotation is on and you just rotate your phone. It's pretty easy to use. Just appears. Huh? Hit that. Mm. Again, both phones must be connected, right? So your uh, iPhone has to be connected to the same Wi Fi as the projector is connected to. And there we go. Voila! iPhone Connect. Just to disconnect, you go back into the panel below on your iPhone, click cast the tree, stop mirroring, and it takes you back to the home screen. The contents from their cell phone using the screen mirroring option. Students can make class discussions engaging by connecting to the projector and show contents to the class from their phone. 
The smart projector is the best teaching and learning solution. Get it today from Digital Dash.